Hi everyone! I don't know why I'm doing this because I'm not any good at makeup. That's why I always get my friend Melissa to do it. But I get a lot of questions asking how I do my makeup, which I think you probably talked about how the professionals do makeup. But just in case you are not talking about that and you're talking about the sh attempt of makeup I put on my face, I've decided I'm going to show you what I do. I don't wear a lot. I don't know how to do eyeshadow, so I, I don't ever have eyeshadow on if I'm doing my makeup. I am going to get Melissa and meet other makeup artists to do some proper tutorials for you. But for the time being, I'm going to give it a go. So, I use two foundations and I mix them together on my hand. This one's Illa Masca, shade 12, and this one is YSL. And when it comes to a foundation brush, I need to actually buy one because I haven't really got one. If you are watching this and you are a makeup artist, please don't take the piss. I know that this isn't a foundation brush. Don't have a go at us. Right. And another thing is I never, ever, ever do my makeup in this awful light. I normally do it in the natural light, but it's getting dark now, so that's one out the window. I always go down on the neck as well. So the foundation is done. Now, a little bit of contour, contour palette. So I just put a little bit of the lighter colour in between my forehead. Not a lot though. And then I dab a little bit under the eyes. And then blend it in normally with a proper blending brush. Once again, I'm going back to the same brush I used in the beginning. I'm using the lip brush and I'm cleaning it with my own saliva from my mouth. That is disgusting. Just need to get all the lipstick off it. And then I'll get the lighter one. I'll put it Now for the dark contour, and I tend to just use the powder if it's during the day and on the night time I'll go for liquid and powder. <sighs> Cut it under here. Same on the other side. That'll do. Oh shit, I've definitely put too much on my forehead. <sighs> Wait and then, same on this side. And then, for example, if you have put a little bit too much on and you get like lines, I get a blending brush and I blend it all in. I'm not going to bother with eyelashes. This is just a during the day, go to the shops, go out for some food with the girls, but the essential is eyebrows. I'll always have eyebrows on. I don't really have any tips of where to draw or how to get them neat because my eyebrows are tattooed on. So I kind of just follow the outline of that like a stencil because they're already permanently fixed into place. Then blusher and then we'll be done. I never ever wear a, a red blusher. I always go for a peachy tone. This one's Modern Mandarin by MAC and it's the only one that I ever, ever buy. It's the only one that I wear. It's dead nice because it doesn't show up too much. It just looks dead natural. And then I'm a big fan of the lips, obviously. I tend to go nude on a night time and a little bit more natural during the day or sometimes a dark brown colour, which I really like. We'll go for Velvet Teddy. So that's it. Hopefully I look a little bit more fresh face now, a little bit more alive but I don't look too glam. Obviously, I would have put a little bit of mascara on, but I've kind of lost my mascara. Shock. So I don't have any of that to put on. I hope you liked it. Give us a comment if you want to know where any of the products are from or what they are or what I use. And remember to like this video and subscribe to my channel. See yous, love yous, bye. Oh no, I know, I know. Damon Sabato. Oh! <laughs> Dim. Oh. Dim. Dim. Uh -huh. I wore this for the NTAs and it's probably the only event I've ever been to. I'm not very well travelled in events kind of things.